Alright, what is up y'all? Welcome back. It has been a minute, I know, but this quarantine, lockdown stuff, I mean, there's not too much we can do. Um, so I've just been riding it out, and I didn't really want to put out too much fluff stuff and random videos for y'all, so I've just been laying low. Um, I have been slowly kind of chipping away at the GTR like I just pulled the front wheels off um, putting the, the wheel speed sensors and stuff back in and trying to figure out where some of these bolts go but uh, <laughs> for the most part just been chipping away now I was trying to hold off and not make a video until I had a little bit of an update for the engine but it ain't happened yet so uh, I should know here in a couple of days what's happening. CRD told me that my engine is next up on the stand to uh, to get put together. So I've already dropped on the head. I got another little shelf here. Kind of help organize everything, make it look better. But um, yeah, like I said, I'm, I'm just going to be working on this. So let me show you what I got going on here. So currently, what I'm trying to do is, one, connect the brakes back up, and the wheel speed sense, the wheel speed sensor, which is right here. I got to do this for the other side as well. So you basically got to silicone them in and all that stuff like that. So that's what I'm gonna do real quick. Rather than you guys sitting here watching me turn a wrench for a couple more minutes. I figured I'd go back and do a little bit, like kind of like I did last time when I, I think it was 25,000 subscribers. Um, I started putting all these little pulls and, and complicate compil compilation videos together. Um, I'll, I'll do another one of that. So we'll cut to that, and then I'll come back and we'll see some progress uh, rather than seeing a time lapse of, of some progress. Um, so I got these tiny little rubber pieces right here, and all this is for is for the jack stand so yeah I'm gonna put that back on the roof of the car too <laughs> so this little rubber piece will sit right on the jack stand just like that subframe or whatever part of the bottom of the car I can put right there and it just protects the car a little bit like I'm doing all this work when I go to a little bit of effort, and I mean this was like thirteen dollars in rubber, which is gonna protect thousands of dollars worth of work. So I went ahead and got two big ones for the jack stand as well, or for the jack. And now I can jack off the subframe, <laughs> jack the subframe up, and um, you know, right there. Anyway, check out this compilation video I thought I'd put together, and it's, this is going to be like basically every car I've filmed, plus my car, and a couple of little, maybe too hot for TV moments in there, but uh, <sighs> this virus got to end, man, it's, it's, it's killing me. Anyway, check that out, I'll see you guys in a minute.
you crazy motherfuckers! <laughs> got these crusty rotors and crusty uh, calipers on here but remember we doing R35 so this stuff will go away so I ain't want to waste no money trying to powder coat it. I, I, I might still powder coat it and then sell them but I don't know I mean they're brand new so I, I didn't want to really do nothing to the rotors but um, I'm just gonna chuck the wheels and tires back on that's the job done for me today and uh, hopefully we get some news about this engine soon. I'm like dying to fill this, dying to fill this big old hole with a RB26. So uh, we uh, we almost there. We almost there. That bonnet liner though, or that hood liner though. Woo. All right, y'all take care. I'll see y'all on the next one.